Open AI made Sora public today. With that, millions of people are going to have access to this powerful tool. Let me first show you how it looks, then we'll talk about what kind of implications it will have on our life. Sora.com is a website we need to use. Since I have Chat GPT Plus plan, I have 1000 credits. If you have Chat GPT Pro plan, which is $200 a month, you get unlimited video creation. Let me show you some videos that I created. I have this chipmunk image. This chipmunk comes into my backyard. I gave her a cherry. So this is a real image. Based on this image, I created this video. Look at this video. It looks real, but this type of thing never happened. Okay. I gave her a cherry, but the scene that you are seeing in the video is artificially generated. Here you have this concept of a storyboard. So when I created this video, I initially uploaded this image and you see this track looks more like a video editing track. It generated this description from the image and then you can add all these frames, you know, so look at this frame. I added a frame saying that the chipmunk is putting away the cherry on the ground. I created a short description and when I click on this, it automatically enhanced this description. Maybe it helps with the video creation, but basically you can add a new description here saying that now chipmunk drinks water. You know, let me just try it. So you can keep on adding all these descriptions. It takes some time to uh, create this video. Meanwhile, let me show you some other videos which I created. Okay, so this is a video of Spider-Man doing Bhangra in the streets of Delhi. <laughs> he looks very happy. I know, see, this is the first version, so it's not perfect. It looks artificial. Sometimes it looks weird. Sometimes it has errors, but just like how chat GPT evolved with every new release, I believe this tool is going to evolve and uh, become better and better. When you generate a video, you, you have this option. See right now I can describe my video and here by default, it will generate two versions of the video. You can say four also. So for Spider-Man, the other version that I, it created was this, see, this looks like a streets of Delhi and he's doing Bhangra. Always Bhangra looks pretty weird to me. Let me create one more video. Okay. Uh, a person selling samosa on the Mars. Let's see how this goes and it will be added in the queue. Okay. Meanwhile, let me show you one more video. So I have this image from where I'm recording this video right now. This is my workstation. So I uploaded this image. Okay. Let me just show you. And I said, you see this person who is walking. So let's see what I said in my storyline. I said, create a video using this image. This is a room of a young Indian YouTuber. He enters the room and sits on the chair things for some time. And then after see after one second or so after that he starts working on a computer. So these are the instructions that I gave and it created this video. Now you see there are some errors like his hand movement. See how his hand kind of appears all of a sudden and then it, it looks artificial, but I'm amazed to see like his shadows on the wall and how it used this image to create this 3d scene. And it looks like this person is walking in the scene. So if you do some uh, prompt refining and if you do some edits, I think you can create a good looking picture out of this. The second version that it created was pretty bad actually. Okay. So it looks buggy and see, I don't know what he's doing. He just disappears as if he's entering the closet. So overall it's okay. Not very happy with it. Then I gave this image of my backyard. Okay. Again, a static image. This is a static image that I gave and I said, okay, create a video out of it. You know, nothing more, no more instructions, create a video using this. And you see this fog moving and I think there is no cloud movement. Okay. So, and these tree leaves are kind of as if there is little wind. See this tree leaves it looks like a video. Let's look at the other one. Now here you see the sun appear and 
sun is going up and then sun is going down so obviously there is some problem but look at the cloud movement cloud movement looks pretty decent even this uh, leaves the tree the wind blowing it looks pretty good pretty decent i would say then i gave another image of my village okay so this is my village in india again a static image and i said in my storyline see in the storyline what i said is two horses come running from the far end of this road and slowly stops and then birds appear in the sky flying from left to right now let's see what it did so you see it looks like a video a tree is moving a bit but there are no horses right do you see any horses no any birds no there is some movement so <laughs> again it's a first version it's buggy the other version of the video was also i mean i did not see any horses here okay so it is definitely not perfect but i was pretty amazed uh, with this chipmunk video that it created and i think it is trying a person selling samosa on the mars so let's see how that goes but while it is doing it let me show you some featured videos okay so featured videos are hand curated this is like a gallery and look at this whenever there is this slow kind of gradual movement like fluid kind of movement it tends to tends to do pretty good and there is a story here see the seed cracks open then the plant stem stretches whatever so it's almost like a video editor where you can add all these instructions and this looks pretty decent to me then let's look at this one this is i think african tribal marriage okay so you will be able to create uh, images you know or videos from some old times as well I also tried uploading my picture, my childhood picture, and I uh, started creating video out of it, but it did not allow me. I think they have some privacy concerns and also it can be pretty dangerous, right? Like you can take somebody, somebody's image and create a fake looking video. So while this tool is powerful, we are going to have some ethical challenges. We need to have some regulation on this tool because I saw one video where you can create a fake CCTV camera capture. Now CCTV camera captures are sometimes used in t detecting crime and so on. So now this becomes a challenge, you know, for the people who are doing those investigation. How do they believe that video is real or fake? The, it, the videos cannot be used now uh, as a proof, you know, in the judiciary system. So it is going to pose a big challenge. But on the other hand, it is going to uh, create a lot of opportunities for people. And when I say opportunities, just think about a creative person sitting in their room will be able to create an entire movie or let's say entire TV series or maybe an ad using this tool. So that's pretty powerful. It is going to democratize the creativity. So if you're a person who has a movie idea, now you don't need to go to Bollywood. You don't, don't need a big budget. If you want to create even a short documentary, short series, you don't need big budget. Maybe you need this plan, you know, ChatGPT plan. And ChatGPT plan right now, pro plan is $200 a month. But with the competition in these models, uh, I think that pricing is going to go down. Okay. While we were talking, it generated the videos okay of chipmunk see chipmunk drinks water but it's not able to capture that see there is no water so again it failed at that let's look at a person selling samosa on the mars okay person selling samosa on the mars oh my god <laughs> what is that okay did a good i mean i would say okay job okay let's look at the other one Okay, you do. You need to wear the space suit, of course, right? These there are few astronauts wearing this space suit. Although this person is just wearing a mask, but see, there is a Mars surface, and there are people walking with the samosas. All right, I think you will have access to all these featured galleries. Look at these videos; it's pretty mind blowing. Like this video was generated using this image. So let me just show you that image so let's look at this particular image right here 
okay so there is this kind of image that they have okay some old image and using that it created this video coming time is going to be very interesting many things are going to be redefined the way we do our creative work is going to be fundamentally transformed